what's up y'all it is a blood tag and i am back with a another video so today we are talking about my weight loss journey yes my weight loss journey i haven't weighed myself but i've looked at myself and i don't really like the way i've been looking lately um, I'm, I'm assuming I'm probably weighing 180 to 190 pounds. I haven't got on the scale yet. I'm gonna get on the scale probably this week, but I, I know that I'm probably around that right now. So, what I plan on doing is, let me, wait, 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 before we start, I'm gonna post a, a before picture. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, what I plan on doing is losing about, I'm not even going to go with pounds, but I'm going to say pounds, probably like 20 to 25 pounds, um, 180, I want to get to like 165. I'm planning on doing that uh, in the next few months before the year is up. That is my goal. That is my goal because your girl looking like she, got, she didn't have kids and ain't never had kids. So yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing. I don't know if it's relationship weight or my job where I sit a lot nowadays. It's way different from being a flight attendant. Your girl gotta get it together. You got to get it together. Yeah. So, your girl got this gallon water bottle I plan on using every single day. Take five gallons. This is like what 64 ounces or something like that. And it has time, it has 8 a.m. all the way to 8 p.m. I go to work at 8 a.m. and I get off around 5, but I like to do 10 to 12 hour shifts sometimes. So I get around, get off maybe sometimes around 8 sometimes. I may do an 8 to 8. Or when I get off work at 5, I go to the gym. So I like that. So these are, these are my essentials. What I'm planning on doing is meal prepping a little bit. Um, most of the time my boyfriend cooks for us, but I, he ain't trying to eat the stuff that I want to eat as far as my meal prep, which is basically ground turkey, potatoes and rice, and spinach. That's all I'm eating throughout the day. Let me show you guys. Put them in these cute little containers. Um, I guess I can open them. This is what I this is what I plan on eating. So I put them in. I smell good. I'm supposed to be eating at four, and then my last meal is seven. The thing that I'm planning on doing is um. It's uh, doing the um, 12, fasting before 12 and after 8, so I'm only eating between the stages of 12 and 8. I've been doing that since Sunday, and I'm not going to lie, it is kind of hard. Um, I never realized how much I eat throughout the day because I, I, I get to starving before 12, and I'm like, damn. Your girl need to learn some self-control. Yeah. So that's what I'm doing. Um that 12 to 8. The 12 to 8 is pretty hard. But that's what I've been doing. I'm on my fourth day of it is Wednesday. I started around Sunday. And um I, I fasted before. I fasted before. I did a one to six in 2021 and I had lost a whole bunch of weight. I lost a lot of weight, but I, don't, I think I need to be 12 to 8, start off a little slow, get, get a few wins in before uh, I get to that. Or if I do get to that, I just want to start, you know, shedding weight and gaining muscle. Um, I plan on working out Monday through Friday, doing any types of walks outside and then going to the gym at my apartment. I really love my apartment gym. It is so nice. It's so nice, guys. So that's what I plan on doing. Uh, I've been doing like Monday, Wednesday, 
Monday, Wednesday, Friday, uh, legs and um, glutes and legs and a little bit of cardio. And then Tuesday and Wednesday, I'm doing arms and back because you gotta get that back. We are delarging our backs. We are delarging our backs. So I'm gonna be doing like weekly updates. I'm really excited about that because y'all get to see the progress with me. I'm gonna be doing some weekly updates where maybe like maybe Sunday or Monday, I post uh, how, I, how I did that week. Um, if you see any differences, you can please comment below. And if you have any suggestions, you can comment below too. I need some more workout clothes so I can feel good at the gym because right now I just got a regular tights and shorts. My boyfriend bought me some cute little lemon clothes. But I don't feel like I want to wear that out. And I, I feel like I, I, uh, I'm too good. Do a little bit too good for the gym? I don't know. But yeah, so I've been wearing that out, but maybe some cute little Amazon workout fits or something. I mean, I do feel like it all come from the same place. So that's another thing. Talked about dinner, but uh, I, I need to talk to you about my breakfast. So what I've been eating is peanut butter with bread and bananas and um, eggs, scrambled eggs with cheese and pan sausage is really good. It lasts me all the way till 4 p.m. And it's, it's delicious. That's probably like my favorite meal of the day. But it keeps me full and it's a very high protein uh, meal. So I've been taking as far as working out. I put this in my cute little water bottle uh, that my grandma bought me. Um, I put this in there, I mix it with water, I shake it up real good. I do not dry scoop because that's bad for you. People that got heart attacks and all that, so don't dry scoop. It's bad. I mean, I ain't the workout queen, but I heard that's bad. I don't like even doing that. We need the hearts to be pumping till we're 150 years old. We need the hearts to be pumping till we're 150 years old, period. This ain't gonna lie. I don't know if I got ADHD, ADD, what, what, ever. But I can't stay in the gym for too long, not because I'm tired, but because I get bored. I try to find the right playlist, and then I end up listening to podcasts, and I think it's because I don't have enough energy. So what I'm... What I'm doing is that that give me a lot of energy to keep me going and moving and shaking and stuff like that. I'm trying to stay on a treadmill for longer than 10 minutes. I can only max out 10 minutes. Not because I'm tired, but because I'll be bored. I'm like, what is I need some stimulation. You know? So that's been slowly but surely getting me to where I need to go. My boyfriend is Jamaican. If you didn't know. And one of his cousins came down and she put me on to this peppermint tea. I don't know if you can see it. This peppermint tea. It is so good. He hates it. But it's good. It's so you drink it in the morning and then you drink it at night and it's supposed to help with the bloating to get that blowed off you because I blow so bad y'all especially when I'm on my cycle but even after I don't know and then I got some probiotics for bloats as well these are pretty cool um I've been taking these I say one daily it's really good for a healthy digestion because I ain't gonna lie I've been struggling with, I don't know if it's IBS, I don't know what it is, but a lot of times when I'm eating really bad, I get constipated and I can't poop. And it, it literally messes with me. And when I can't poop, it messes with my mood and I feel like your stomach is connected to your brain and it messes with your mental health. And I heard that your gut can cause anxiety and depression if you don't clean it out. So I'm cleaning this mess out. I'm really excited about it. I mean, another thing is I gotta prove myself, prove to myself that I can continue to do it because my birthday is in February. My birthday is in February and I ain't gonna count. I wanna be bad. I want the 
stomach to be and a booty to be and I want to be bad period so that's what I plan on doing and Christmas I'm supposed to be going out the country so I'm already saving a bit Stupid. Okay, so it, 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 I'm supposed to be going out the country at Christmas, so I'm really excited about that. So I right, gotta be stomach in, booty out, chest up, period. No. Okay. I'm having a little bit too much fun with this video. Hopefully somebody is watching. Hopefully somebody is watching something. I'm going to be taking some before and after pictures each week. And I need y'all to stay updated on it. And I'm going to try to track it with me. Track it with you, girl. Because I'm ready. I'm ready, okay? I'm ready. You want to follow my journey on this. I'm going to need you to like, comment, and subscribe. Period. But yeah, um, it's been real. I love you guys. Thank y'all to all 111.